Hey guys, uh, Credit Junkie here. Just to give you guys an update on my portfolio. Like I said on the last video that I'll make the next video when I hit 10K. So today is the day it finally happened. 10K, $10,008. As you guys can see from the last video, my tech was the most valuable. Now it's consumer since uh, the recent tech sell-off. Uh, and the portfolio on the tech side did go down a little bit uh, but other than that everything's pretty similar as last time uh, in terms of dividends uh, I just received a dollar seventy one from uh, 3m yesterday and then I received so 762 all at one that was probably my most dividends in one day seven dollars and 62 cents so far uh and i've been buying a lot just you know all the undervalued company i've been buying all of those and i also uh, started my roth ira uh i'm all, i only have three it's the vanguard s p 500 realty income and at and so and the thought process behind it that i don't want to pick individual stock for this uh so you know i have s p 500 but also i wanted you know a monthly income and realty income seems a uh, very good monthly income stock and i picked at and just to uh, uh, offset the the low percentage on Vu on uh, Vanguard S&P 500 I believe it's like 1.73 so if I go view detail my uh, total uh, dividend yield is 3.29 percent and my expense is 0.2 so that you know ups, uh, offsets the expense ratio and also the low dividend that's why I have AT&T and Realty Income other than that, uh, everything is the uh, same as last time, but finally $10,000. And uh, the next video, I'll probably make uh, once I hit another $100 of dividend. So the last $100 dividends, I believe I hit it back in June or July. One of those months, I'm going to have to go back and check, but... Uh, I, I said on that episode that, you know, how long, I'll see how long it takes to hit another $100. So, we'll see. Anyway, thank you guys uh, for watching the update, and I'll see you guys in the next video.